Hi, welcome to Arts All Overs uh, Roadside Cooking. Uh, today I'm making a meal out of a can, beef stew. And what I did was this. I'm at my campsite here out in Big Sur, California. I'm enjoying the weather out here, Carmel Valley, Big Sur. And uh, this is it. I used, uh, I got me some rubbing alcohol here. It's 91%, so it's pretty. Pretty potent because you know isopropyl alcohol has water in it, and you get the percentages. And what I do is I have a Pacific. I had some sardines in a can in here, and I use this container. I liked it because it's the right size, not too much, not too little. And I have a little metal piece here that looks like this that I found along the roadside. This is all stuff I scavenged here and there, or I you know purchased to uh, make food with, or have food. And uh, I put it across here to give the stability here for the can. And uh, as you can see, the flames get a little high. But it's controllable. I have uh, my safety net, which is, this is water in here. So I'm able to control all that. And uh, as you can see, these stew is getting nice and hot. You just have to watch the times when the flames move back and forth from the wind, which they invariably do, that you don't maybe burn your delicate skin, you know. And uh, I I have a thing to pick cans up, but uh, mm. man, it's already it's already warming up the. So there you have it for today, Art's Roadside Cooking. That's the meal. Uh, you too can do the same thing. All you need is a can. Get some uh, uh, rubbing alcohol. The higher the percentage, the, the better, I think, for burning. You can use any quantity. You're going to have water residue left over, the less uh, percentage it is. And uh, put it in the container, you know, in a little piece of a tissue like this to uh, light it with a lighter and then you just put it in the alcohol. It's not going to flame up like gasoline or anything, so you don't need to be concerned about that. And and there you have uh, in a can of food, you know, just open a can up. You know, they used to call it the old hobo cooking. So this here is the uh, Arts Roadside <laughs> roadside Cooking or AKA Roadside Hobo Cooking. And we're going to have some hot beef soup for lunch. There it is sizzling away. Man, it looks really good. I'm just doing this. Sometimes, you know, if the heat's on there for too long, uh, you know, it tends to stick it to the bottom a little bit. But this year's turned out really well. And you can see the flames out now. It's just burned the residue of that uh, tissue. And the meal's done. You don't need very much rubbing alcohol to uh, make a meal you know like in this container i only filled it probably that much in the container it's, it was probably 10 minutes worth of uh, fuel which is very much i want to let the can sit here for a minute cool down and i have a uh, i have a cloth over here that i'm going to use to uh, hold the can when i get ready to eat it but i'm going to cool down just for a minute on the outside but there you have it, another episode of our Hull Over Roadside Cookie. Enjoy your day. Listen to the birds sing. Oh, my hand out in the way. <laughs>